Me, personally, I'm a fan of using ghee and also the grass-fed water buffalo. If you've never had grass-fed water, bu water buffalo butter, I'd highly recommend you try it because it's really, really great. And for those of you that do have issues with digestion when it comes to things like dairy, then water buffalo, it is going to be a lot easier to digest. Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in and welcome back to another Carnivore Q&A. Steven here with Team Euphoric and today we're going to be talking about the BBBE diet. This is a follow-up from last week's video. Last week somebody had asked if you were allowed to have sausages on the BBBE diet and we're going to get into what exactly you can have. So with regard to the BBBE diet, what exactly is it? Well, the first B stands for beef and beef, it doesn't literally mean just beef. It refers to all ruminant animals. So you could have things like cow, bull, goat, sheep, deer, as long as it's a ruminant animal you can have it if you want to be strict with the bbbe diet then the second b is going to be bacon with regard to bacon this is why somebody was asking if if sausages were allowed because they thought that since bacon was allowed did that mean that all pork was allowed according to the bbbe diet if you want to be really strict then pork bacon is going to be the only pork product that is going to be allowed then the third b that is going to be butter it's butter, not margarine. So if you are going to be consuming butter, it has to be actual butter. And with regard to butter, you could have any type of butter that you want. It could be grass-fed butter. It could be grass-fed water buffalo. You could also have ghee because ghee is clarified butter. Me, personally, I'm a fan of using ghee and also the grass-fed water buffalo. If you've never had grass-fed water, bu water buffalo butter, I'd highly recommend you try it because it's really, really great. And for those of you that do have issues with digestion when it comes to things like dairy, then water buffalo, it is going to be a lot easier to digest. At least for me, that seems to be the case. And and also for a lot of my clients and patients, they do seem to do really well on things like water buffalo. Then the E in BBBE is going to stand for eggs. And this could be absolutely any kind of eggs. You could have chicken eggs, duck eggs, quail eggs, ostrich eggs, fish eggs. As long as it is an egg, you can have it. But that's pretty much it. So BBBE, it's beef, bacon, butter, and eggs. You could have ruminant animals. You could have bacon as your only form of pork. You could have any type of butter that you want as long as it's real butter and not margarine. And you could have any type of egg that you want. That's it for today's video. If you guys have any questions at all with regard to anything that I discussed today, go ahead and ask your questions down in the comment section so I can help you guys out. But that's pretty much it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to smash that like button so I'm going to keep making these types of videos in the future. And if you're either new to the channel or haven't subscribed yet, be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bells. I'm going to be uploading new videos every single day. That's it for today's video. Thanks for tuning in, and I will see you again tomorrow.